What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Skull Network. My name is Nick, and we have major, major news coming out of the world of the Minnesota Vikings. Came up about 15, 20 ish or so minutes ago from Adam Schefter. Minnesota Vikings quarterback Kirk Cousins said that he had symptoms, self reported, and is now tested positive for COVID 19 on the eve of probably the most important game of the season, Sunday Night Football, against the Green Bay Packers to keep playoff hopes alive plus having Adam Thielen out, and now Kirk is going to be missing Sunday Night Football. Now, I'm not going to be talking about Kirk's vaccination status because I don't talk about that stuff on this channel. I'm talking football, and I'm talking the Minnesota Vikings. So you guys can go have your own conversations on that. But, of course, what this means for the team is, well, <laughs> I might be one of the biggest idiots on the Internet. If you remember my video a couple days ago when Kyle Slaughter was picked up and put on the active roster, I said he's not going to be seen in the field. Now, maybe we kind of know why he was picked up in the first place. Yes, originally it was because Sean Manny was also on the COVID list, but maybe they knew that Kirk had maybe shown symptoms. I don't know. I'm just speculating, obviously, but looks like we're probably going to be seeing Kyle Slaughter start his first game in the NFL, unless something crazy happens and Sean Mannion is able to put up two negative tests. But honestly, I don't necessarily see it. And obviously, we're probably not going to see Kellen Mond because they put Kyle Slaughter on the active roster over him. So, this is definitely going to be a weird one and definitely a dream come true for many Vikings fans who loved Kyle Soder and wanted to keep him on the team years ago when he was our practice squad and preseason hero. So obviously this is going to make things a lot more difficult. There's going to be a lot of reliance on Dalvin Cook. It's a cold game anyway, so there is going to be a lot of focus on the run game, but... I don't know. We'll see. Will this be the end of the Kirk Cousins era? Will Kyle Slaughter take over for the foreseeable future after this? Well, no, but man, this is just some absolutely major news, and it really does put a damper on what was probably going to be a great game. And that's the extent of the news right now. There's obviously not a lot out about it. I mean, it's all the basics. So get ready to watch some Kyle Slaughter. More than likely, guys. It's going to be, again, very weird, and this might be hard to watch or who knows maybe it'll be great I'm, I'm remaining optimistic but yeah tomorrow should be the Kyle Slaughter show since Kirk Cousins has tested positive for COVID-19 if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you give it a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already I'll see you guys all in the next video the recap between the Minnesota Vikings and the Green Bay Packers coming out on Monday adios